So this is after the expo and getting food. We got the we can't stop buying toys. Oh, we're clearly, <laughs> but yeah, we're going to GameStop. We drove two hours, so fact, two <laughs> hours out here to Spartanburg. It was worth the drop. And my nigga, this GameStop looks big it's as fuck. fuck. <laughs> so let's see. Let's see. Oh, this is only $90. 24 years later, and a remake of the game released last year that simultaneously gave them new delights and left them wanting more. Hours of character development fleshed out everyone more deeply. Yeah, that's what I was looking at. I still like the zombie journey. Oh, look. Was, yeah, the zombie mode out. Yeah. What Transformers is this? Because you know I love Transformers. Oh, okay. Sound wave. Might have to. Might have to get the sound wave, but we're going to put it back. <laughs> just to see. We got a way off. So this is yeah, like we need to just leave it. Oh my, hold on. Yeah, this is crazy. This is my first GameStop I've ever seen with this head. It's free play. So you can be here all day. Now, you remember the kids coming to GameStop and trying to run it? I hate you. You're trying to beat some messages trying to beat them up. I'm 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 trying to beat them up. I'm
and looks like this is 955 out of 10,000 and it comes with the certificate of authenticity so these are some sketches that we picked up today at the comic con uh, it was a guy named Mel Rivera and his IG if you want to check him out is Mel Mel Rivera 101 on IG as Mel Rivera 101 I tagged him on my story if you had seen on my IG he does these cool sketches um, it also comes with a frame as well my figures that I picked up um, so of course I have a Vader Dark Maul, Grand Moff Tarkin. I have another Royal Guard. Look at this Moff Grand. Look at the Grand Moff Tarkin. It has like a like a hologram card back or whatever. And mind you, these are all five dollars. So um, we also have the Episode One. Now this is the Destroyer Droid. So these used to be the joys that had the shield that like came around them. This one was 15 actually. And then I have Quagon Jin, Queen Amidala. This is a two pack, this was 10. I have a Star Wars Saga with Yoda. This is pretty cool. And then it also comes with this in the back, a hologram Yoda. Um, I think this was five too. Um, then we have a baby Anakin, which was five, I believe. A uh, Palpatine, which was five. Another Vader, which was three dollars, and then last was my Boba Fett, which was five dollars as well. <laughs> so that's everything, guys. Of course, you guys know Brooke came with me as well, so she did have some pickups as well. And <laughs> so it looks like she picked up. She definitely picked up a tad bit more a items, tad bit more? <laughs> way more items than me. Um, well, I think figures we have yeah. about the same almost. Yeah. But comics and. You know, the other stuff yeah, for sure. And stuff. Yeah, so these are also her sketches that she got from Melva River again. This I mean guys, you have to really look at the details, details and these like it's crazy. Like he really and did this, his thing. This Yoda right here is actually like Yeah, really I gotta show that Yoda in close. This Yoda Ugh, this Yoda is so detailed, like it's crazy. I'm gonna put it right next to the archive Yoda you got me in that versus. That's like my favorite. The my archive, top five. that's yeah. my top five favorite like figures out there. That the archive know. Yoda is tough. I'm meant to buy that for myself. <laughs> <laughs> so first, let's just start off with the Funk Pop. Range Trooper. This is the Range Trooper. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this one is tough. So, if you guys notice, we did get a lot of like the old Star Wars stuff, which we love, which is the, yeah, yeah. Is, which is exactly the stuff we like. I finally got me a carbonized um, Mando, and so, this yeah. is good. Do I um, see that carbonized Mando? This is tough. CP three O looks fire as hell in that yeah. episode one. Cause look at like. So this is the original CP three PO. This is actually the one that Baby Anakin made. So that's fire. You can see the details and that. It actually shows the inside. Like that's fire. It shows the wiring. I love that. Um, so yeah, Brooke has a lot of good stuff. Stormtrooper. I got flight pilot. And yeah. show. Fighter pilot. I showed you the Stormtrooper. Mando. Carbonized. Princess Leia. Now this is the one when she was tied up to Jabba the Hutt. She even has the chain that you could put on her ankle. That's tough. And these also comes with like the freeze frame action style. I don't know if you could see. But um, it is too dark. But 
Um, Dark Mole with the hood, which is tough. Oh, yeah, Mia Pal. Um, Brooke got her Palpatine also as well. Then I got a Han. And then those out the box, out the bag. Yeah. I got, he, he's, I don't know his name, but he gave them to me uh, four of those for $20. And I already wanted to buy some figures to take out of the box to so this was perfect. Count Dooku was a really good pickup and then so, Karen Jacks. Count Dooku. And yeah. So yeah, so Brooke has I some figures that's that poster right. that I got too. You Go on. You think I should open it? Hey, sure. Come on. This opens so. up. They had a but he had a bunch of these and they had official like monthly posters. Yeah. And then it Look at that, guys. That's dope. Oof. That's so dope. Dang, this poster is tough. Is she just probably going to get it laminated? Yeah, I'm going to go to my right. classroom and laminate it. This is tough, classroom. guys. Yeah. You don't really see posters that look like this. They always look like, kind of like... Like, that is so retro. Like, you can't yeah. get any more retro than that. Like, that's a this is also the comic books Brooke picked up. Uh, these are... She also picked up some Dark Horse comics. Um, Star Wars, so... I've, I have a few Dark Horse comics already, so it's okay. not my first time. So, yeah, this isn't her first time getting those. Some DC, uh, Superman, some Batman. Some more Transformers. This Batman, one is actually Transformers comic. And this is a... Transformers. This, this Transformers right here, actually, is a UK print. So, this and one they, is from UK. That's yeah, crazy. That's a UK print, which is actually kind of different than the American one. Yeah, you can even tell by the uh, Marvel and blue. Yeah. It looks way different. The comic is actually bigger, too. So yeah, these are pretty these, cool. These two as well, because you know I love Transformers. I didn't get any Transformers figures, but it's okay. I have enough. I yeah. Here. You got, did you show them that Patrick? Yeah. Also got the Patrick in the cut. <laughs> <laughs> so, out of your... Figures, which one would you say is your favorite? Or what's your top two? My top two is going to have to definitely be that Carbonized Mando. Because I'm Carbonized that. Mando? That was, I've been one of that. And then... Carbonized shoot. Mando is tough. My set... Mm, I'm going by figures or just my pickups? Oh, uh, just... Yeah, figures okay. that you picked up today. Okay, because if it's going by pickups, it would be the Mando and then my Boba Fett paint, like print. Or the Mando and that Dark Maul. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't think I even zoomed in on this one. So, yeah, she has the Episode 1 Dark Maul with the hood on. This is CP3 is probably behind it just because that's an original, you know? Yeah. Dope. This Maul is actually tough. I don't know if the hood comes off of this one. But. I don't know. This is Brooke's Dark Maul and then. <sighs> This is my dark mall. Which one do you guys like? I'm not gonna lie, I like the one with the hood, and then I also like the episode one in the background, the card. But then this one is different because it has the um, actually shows the horns in his head, which is tough. And then it has like this little, you know, I don't even know what it is. And just to show you guys a comparison of the carbonized mando and the regular one so it is a huge difference actually like i know it has the sticker but if you actually this is just like a regular black background and then the cardboard is actually kind of like fl not flimsy but sort of flimsy now when it's carbonized it's like the background is brownish and it's super like sturdier so, but yeah, I appreciate you guys tuning in for another toy hunt. And yeah, see you guys in the next video. Mm. Bye. Bye.